Okay, so this video is about what supplies you will need to take care of your dwarf bunny. Well, it really applies to any, but mine is a dwarf bunny, so I'm just calling it that. But it really applies to any bunny. So, they need like a little um, chew toys for them so that their teeth don't get like really. Um, they need some chew toys so that their teeth don't get super. Um, so their teeth don't get super long and so you don't have to cut their teeth because it's gross when you have to cut them. So I have, this is one of the two toys, um, it is like this little chew toy thing and you can clip it onto their cage door or the cage or whatever you have for them that it will clip onto. Sorry about my hand getting in the way. And then, so that's her little chew toy. And then I also have this. I stuff it with hay and pellets and stuff, but you can actually hang it with paper string in their cage and it's like a little carrot wooden toy so she can chew on that and eat out of it. And then, as for other toys, I just have this little paper ball that I crinkled up and she likes to move around and chew on it a little bit. And then I have this, it has like some, um, like hay and some yummy things in there for her and it has a wooden cover and she likes that. And then now I will go on to the food. Okay, so she is munching on her hay that she has. So for the hay, I have a little job of my bunny supplies. So hold on. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to end the video and come back. And sorry about the small cage. Um, it's just a cat carrier because we are going to get her a much bigger cage today. I have only had her for a little bit, so she hasn't had to be in there in that tiny thing for just too long. She is still eating hay. So, again, sorry about the small cage and it's dirty. So, for the food, you need um, some hay. I get this at Target. They don't have, Target doesn't have a big selection of like hay and just rabbit things, period. They only have like a small section. So, it's not very much so. So I got this Western Katie, Western Timothy hay. I get that. And then it's very big size and then it has a picture of it's like the guinea pigs, bunnies, and the soldiers. But really, any animal that needs hay, it's just fine for. So I gave her some of that every day. And then I have these Katie, again at Target, 40 diet foods. Oh, sorry. This is like $7.99. And then this, I think, is 10 bucks. $10.99, but it will last you a long time, like half of a year or something. And I have not gotten her salt books yet. They will get here tomorrow, though. So, 40 diet, and then a little bunny on the picture. It's for rabbits. And then, so it's KD 40 diet pellets. You don't want to give them too much every day, so like I said, it'll last half a year to a year. Ten. Oven box. And then, for another thing for the feeding is, um, sorry, my legs in the film. So, another thing 
for the feeding is water. They always need water. Sorry, Benny. I'll give it back to you in a minute. Um, so, I just have this heavy-ish bowl, and it would be hard for her to get a grip on, too, so she can't throw it around like she used to with, like, lids and stuff. She actually pooped in one. Hey. Hey, baby girl. Hey. So, that's her water. You want to clean it out, like, give them fresh every few days, and I cannot give her her water yet, because she's at the front of her cage, so I will just be paying attention to you there. So, then. Okay. So, the next step is the litter box. She's still eating hay. Um, the next step is the litter box. Um, so, enter the cage period. Um, sorry, I am a little bit hungry, so my tummy might make some noises. So this is her litter box. She just pooped in it, and I need to clean it out. I have not yet cleaned out her litter box today. And I usually just pick out the poops and change out her litter, like, every other day or so. And then I just use horse stall pellets for litter. And then, um... For cleaning it out, I will close up her cage real quick. And for the litter box, I just got this for five bucks at Target. I get pretty much everything for her at Target. The cat carrier we already had because we have a cat. So this is just a little scooper. Cat litter scooper. You can also get these at the dollar store, but I got this kit. For the books. So, there's cat litter scooper for their litter box or their bedding or whatever you use for them. And then this is for the cage. Um, it's like a little broom and dust pan. And then we just sweep it out every morning. And then. Um, this is just the little thing for them that you carry the things in and you can hang it on the side of the cage. But I'm thinking I might put something in, like right there, and then use it as a hay rack. Might stick something in right there with the sheep so that it would go all the way down to the bottom and just waste the hay. And then she could just like pop up and take the hay that's at the top that I gave her. And then. I will put my supplies back in a minute, so I will um, stop the video and come back on. Okay, sorry, my video has been going on for quite some time, and so she is arranging her cage how she wants it to look, I guess. Sorry, her cage is dirty, but as like I said, we are getting her a new cage today, so... Um, I'm gonna just wait until that, until we get that to clean up her cage, because then she won't be needing this cage anymore. And then our cat can use it again as his crate and his carrier. Huh. Yeah. Okay. So, um, I have towels in the bottom, but now I was going to discuss grooming for... So I'm going to turn it off and come back on. Okay, so I grabbed my bunny. And I'm holding her. So for the grooming, um, she has short hair, so I don't have a brush or anything. But for the long hair ones, you have to brush them. And you can just... Get small pet brushes and just brush them the way you put their fur. And for handling, um, 
all you do is like you just hold them securely like how I am right now. She feels secure. And so I am good. So that is how you handle them. So. Okay, so now I am putting her in her cage. And so I'm going to sit this. Hold on. Sit my iPod like that, and then you can see in the cage kind of. There we go. So I'm putting her in bum first so that she won't get all excited or anything. I'm going to put her in bum first, and I'm holding her securely. And here she goes. Right in her cage. And there she is. I can give her her water back and her toys and everything, and I will do that and come right back on. So, usually, um, I just give her this when I'm doing the floor time or something, but since she's getting the bigger cage today, I will be able to give that to her. She is still eating. She must be hungry. We think she might be pregnant. I mean, she might just have a healthy plump tummy, but she might be pregnant. So. We only have one rabbit, but we got her from the shelter, so we don't know. And then, um, that's all we can think of for how to take care of your rabbit, so bye until next time. Okay, before I go, I just wanted to do a cute, quick... Film of her cleaning herself. She's cleaning her face. It's too bad she's not facing in this direction. But she is cleaning her face. I just wanted to do that. So, thanks for watching. Goodbye.